Hi besties, welcome back to another vlog. My name is Michaela Amara. If you have never seen my face before, but if you have, hey bestie, welcome back. Today I'm filming either a weekly vlog or a weekend in my life. I don't really know what I'm gonna call it. I was gonna call it a weekend in my life, but today is actually Thursday and I want this video to stretch all the way till Sunday. So that's basically like a week, so it's basically like a weekly vlog. So I'm gonna probably just title it a weekly vlog. It is Thursday, it is 1.52, I'm already and I'm out the house. I have some errands to run today i need to go get gas because my tank is on e it's either i'm getting gas at half a tank or i'm getting gas when my gas light is on there's no in between with me we got a lot of fun stuff happening this weekend so i'm super excited besides getting gas i do have a couple other errands i want to run i really want to go thrifting today which i really don't thrift and i want to get into thrifting because you can find a lot of good pieces by just going to the thrift store you can get these pieces for the low y'all so i want to hit either play-doh's closet or goodwill plus today i'm all by myself so it's just kind of like a solo day i might grab boba or something because i have no drink on me right now i got duncan earlier and i don't want any coffee that's basically what's going on for right now i feel myself kind of getting hungry too so i might grab some food from somewhere later on but i kind of just want to get my errands and stuff that i need to get done out of the way because i have a very busy day tomorrow i also have a video uploading right now at the house so hopefully that's finished by the time i get back recently i don't know why but my videos have been taking so long to upload and i've been hearing a lot of other content creators say the same thing i'm not going to keep talking y'all's head off let's just go ahead and head to the gas station before we be on the side of the road you guys so i just got my gas and it was literally 33 dollars to fill up my tank well it's past full i got 360 miles so that's really not bad but gas is expensive right now it's like 279 i think and i could have definitely found it cheaper somewhere else but i was thinking they were gonna have the cheapest gas it said 258 online but it was really 279 and like at this point i'm already on this side of town i honestly don't know where i'm about to go now oh my gosh i should have parked somewhere so i can find out where goodwill is because i know it's somewhere over here in this area so i think i'm probably gonna do that i'm gonna just park. well i can actually look it up well fuck the light is green now um goodwill is literally right here yes okay i'm literally so smart good thing i was about to pull over because the goodwill i'm looking at and i'm really just going into goodwill to find like a cute little pullover or something wondering like girl what happened i was out of there just as quick as i walked in and i looked around for a little bit i honestly felt so out of place honestly because the way everything was lined up now the only place that i have actually been thrifting is play-doh's closet and they have everything sectioned off and then labeled so in there it was just like everything is mixed around but it's organized by colors if that makes sense so i would literally have to look through every single piece of clothing in there which i know is probably like the joy of thrifting is like looking through stuff and finding good pieces but for me child i need to know what's jackets i need to know what's jeans what sizes these jeans are for are these men's jeans are these female jeans so i was pretty much in and out of there i'm just gonna go to play those closet i know i have better luck in there and then also i know how their things are broke down their stuff is even broke down by sizes so i'm able to look at specific things and specific sizes and i feel like that just works better for me and my brain because when i got in there i'm just like whoa what the fuck am i looking at and it kind of stressed me out i kind of got overwhelmed so i was just like yeah i have to get out of here because i don't know what i'm doing and i don't know what i'm looking at and i feel so out of place because it looks like everybody in there knows what they're doing my stomach is rumbling grumbling and tumbling 
and I'm right beside Chipotle so I'm wondering if I should just go in there and get some food um plus I'm um, by the good Chipotle I can go in there and eat and like have a little solo date with myself and just grab some food right quick and I honestly think that's what I'm gonna do because I have to use the bathroom as well My stomach is so full. That Chipotle bowl was so good. I just had Chipotle the other day and that was the best bowl I didn't ever have from Chipotle. And I'm very proud of myself that I actually ate inside of the restaurant all by myself. Although I didn't talk because they had music playing. There's two different Chipotles in my city. Whenever I come to this one, my food is always more. Like it was $16.99. I went to Chipotle the other day, like the other one, and it was $11.99. And I got the same exact order, same exact thing. So I don't really know what that's about but it's 308 now so i'm about to go ahead and head to plato's closet and see if i could find anything in there I'm trying to be more conscious about my spending because it's it's horrible i'm trying to you know save money at least a little if i don't find anything in there i probably just have to do laundry and think about the outfits that i do have but it's like i have no clothes to wear anywhere like even this outfit that i'm wearing right now it is way too cold to be wearing this outside like it's 59 degrees i guess i kind of get a pass but either way it's cold and i have no real cold clothes i only have summer clothes like girl what the fuck happened i really don't even remember the last thing i recorded after i left out of play-doh's closet i went to target to look to see if i could find anything else couldn't find anything the clothes section was just ass i don't know what i was thinking i was gonna find with christmas being like three four days away at this point point. and then around 7 30 i had a hair appointment so i went to go get my hair done by the time i was getting my hair done i was so fucking tired but by the time i got home i literally just knocked out so it is 9 a.m i've been up since nine o'clock on the dot because coda is crying and coda is crying because he threw up he threw up in his crate mm -hmm. so i'm gonna have to clean that up which is disgusting today i'm actually taking a solo road trip to michaela if you're new here you probably don't know who michaela is but if you're an og then you know who michaela is but she's been on my channel multiple times she lives about like an hour 30 minutes away from me i drove to her city multiple times but i've never just like drove by myself so today i'm driving by myself and also michaela moved so i'm super excited to see her new place so i'm taking that road trip today by myself and i need to leave by 11 30 and it's not 11 and i need to shower um pack pack my clothes pack my makeup pack everything get food and then get on the road all by 11 30 so child pray for me because i always tell michaela like, yeah i'm gonna be there by one o'clock i'm gonna be there by one o'clock i pull up at 1 30 i pull up at two o'clock i pull up at three o'clock so yeah that's my tea only thing i'm really worried about is this drive because y'all i do not know how to read a gps i know how to read a gps but like barely so i'm scared because i've never drove down there like just with just me I want to show y'all what I got from Play-Dohs yesterday. This is hurting my head. The first thing I got was this cute little like Sherpa jacket. It kind of looks cropped. And this is from Arizona and I got it in a size medium. I seen one in there that was from Aerie and it was literally like $35. But this one was only $8. So I'm like, yeah, this is more of a steal. And it's just like a light brown color. And I think I'm going to wear this with like some leggings and my Uggs. Mm, basic i know and then i found this little top i got this because it was honestly so cute it's in a size small and it's from fashion nova and it has the original tag on it and it was only eight dollars as well if i had baggy jeans to wear with this it would be really really cute but i'm gonna bring this too i really need to pack it's 9 46 it's like why do i procrastinate so bad A 
okay so it is now 11:03, and not your girl on time not me on time i mean i'm three minutes behind because i really wanted to leave at my cards are going to start beeping like just hush please i am three minutes behind because i wanted to leave at 11 o'clock i had to clean out Koda's crate because he threw up in it and now i am at the trash can because i have so much trash in my car not really so much but i have trash i need to throw this away right quick I'm gonna run to Dunkin' before I go to get something on my stomach because I'm hungry and I started seeing stars earlier. So I'm actually passing by the Dunkin' that I always like never go to. And I'm trying to think if I should just go there or go to the one, should I turn and just go to this Dunkin' that way I can, because it's closer. Yeah. I'ma just see. I'ma just see if it's hitting on something today. Normally I don't go to this Dunkin' because their food isn't good. Not so much their coffee. Like their coffee is very iffy. But I haven't been back in a while. So maybe they might have changed some stuff up and then that way I can get to Michaela's house a lot quicker because I wouldn't be all the way on the other side of town. And I'm just about to go ahead and put Michaela's address into my car place so I can already have it. Let me park right here so I can get my life together because I'm not gonna have time to do it. But right now it says she's an hour and 39 minutes away. Flood warning? Is it raining? So yeah, we need to go ahead and go. And it says I'll get there at 1247. Hi, can I have a medium iced coffee? And can I also have the maple sugar bacon sandwich with American cheese? Thank you. How you doing? I'm doing good. Thank you. Have a nice day. You too. And my drink actually looks good today. We're gonna taste it and we're gonna see what it's hitting on because it it looks the right color. Everything looks right. So, mm -hmm. let's see the sandwich. So, mm -hmm. I'm just about to eat and drive for a little bit. I'm about to be on the way to Michaela's, and I'll update you guys later. Because for right now, I'm just gonna be eating and listening to music, and that's boring. So, yeah. All right, besties. So I am six minutes away from Michaela's house. I did not vlog this whole entire time because I was honestly scared. I mean, I wasn't scared. The drive was like not bad at all, but I just don't know where I'm going. Oh my gosh. Okay, neighborhood. Michaela better eat. Y'all are watching me be confused in like real time because I'm trying to figure out where is this bitch's car? Oh, okay. I see her car. Okay. I'm about to text her and tell her I'm here. Oh, damn. She was waiting on me. <laughs> she was waiting on me at the fucking door. Hi. So, it's 1.33. Me and Mac are in Walmart house shopping because she needs stuff for her house. Um, yeah. She's getting toothpaste and she should be vlogging, but of course she forgot her camera. So I don't know when she will return <laughs> to YouTube from her hiatus, but. <laughs> Clearly it's not that serious for me too, because I just keep leaving it. Yeah, she just said fuck it, so that's fine. Maybe we'll try again tomorrow. All right, y'all, so we're back at Max's house. I was just eating some candy, that's why I'm like chewing. Michaela is setting up her Wi-Fi and it's 3.34, we just, took all this stuff upstairs like we're grown men. I'm trying to like not show y'all everything cause we are gonna wait for her to post and show y'all. She's setting up the Wi-Fi cause she's a technician, I guess. <laughs> bro, cause why the fuck they didn't send somebody out here? <laughs> I didn't know you had to do it by yourself. Bro, yes. <laughs> oh yeah, we about to put everything up that we just got cause we just went shopping. I'm gonna let Michaela vlog the putting up process cause you, you should do a haul. So it is now 7.16. Michaela didn't even do no haul. Did we even put up all the rest of the shit? We're about to go get some food. Y'all, it took us like, <laughs> I don't know how long to set up the Wi-Fi and build the cube thing. It was just a lot. So now we're about to go get some food because we're hungry. Um, and it's literally hours later. I think the last time I talked to y'all was like three o'clock. So yeah, we're about to go get some Zaxby's and Michaela wants something sweet. Oh, and see the Christmas lights. Oh, it's freezing out here. Yeah, I'm getting all my stuff out of my car to put in my Kayla's car. So, I'm gonna have to put y'all down for a quick sec. What a sweet tea and a hot honey mustard. Then I have another number four, boneless with sunflower. I hate when I can hear myself. Just like at Bojangles. Bojangles and fucking, um, <laughs> and probably in that bitch like some dumb shit. He probably in there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. She 
gigi weekend. Oh, the lighting is bad because it's like early well it's not early it's 11 23 and we are going to duncan going to dunkin donuts to get our nice coffee and then we're going to go to virginia to shop for michaela's house we're going to take a little virginia trip but you know we got ready and everything and that's pretty much tea. this is what we're looking like we're looking very much warm and cozy so yeah we're just figuring out what we're about to order so we can know when we get there but y'all the lines around here be so long it's like they only got one of everything so everybody be at one spot we was in the zaxby's line for like i don't know how long i don't even remember the last time i talked to y'all we went to go see christmas lights and i did record that and then we had zaxby's i don't even eat zaxby's in my own city but that shit was good as fuck that's basically the tea we about to go get some food and i'll update y'all when i get my fucking order i might try a new drink today but mm. i don't know we'll see probably not because y'all know how i be <laughs> <laughs> anything else for me? no that's all yeah you're out I don't use the Duncan app. Damn, Michaela, okay, you about to. <laughs> Go ahead and y'all, Michaela just rolled past. Go ahead. Y'all, Michaela just rolled past <laughs> the fucking drive through window. Mm, that look good as fuck. Thank you. You're welcome. Back out. <laughs> <laughs> Can I curbside this and it be ready right today? Like, That's what I'm there ain't no call for help, but like anyway, like can we ring a bill or like something? Like a phone, you know how they had the phone? Like we need assistance to our what is this called? So basically, we did all of that just to curbside it because we're weaklings. Can't do it. And we always talk about we don't need no man. Looks like we do. But our next issue is gonna be getting, getting this bitch up the stairs. stairs. So we just left out of Target. We got the little bit of stuff that we oh, needed. It's ready for pickup. Oh, In store really? pickup. What? We was about to go, but I want to show y'all what I got from Target because I don't know if I told y'all I've been wanting to try the Kim A Alani, but I got my hands on it and I picked up two. I don't even know if I'm gonna like it. Yeah. <laughs> you can uh, go ahead, boo. Yo, I kid you not. <laughs> I just got in the car and cut my GPS on to go to um, Home Goods, and I got a notification saying that my pickup order was ready. So. <laughs> Y'all, so we're in Dick's and the line is half a store long. The line goes all the way to the motherfucking Ruta to the Tuta, basically. And we're we're in line for these. She can order these off Amazon. I want them today. But she want them today. Oh, there's the worst ones. And I have to pee anyways, so. Um, yeah, I'm about to run to the bathroom. Hopefully by the time I get back, she's like all the way up there somewhere. But this line is moving kind of fast though. Intro clip. So we're now in TJ Maxx. Michaela found her two bedside tables. So the worker is bringing them up to the front for us. And now we're just looking around because we didn't know how we we're going to carry them fucking things. But we still have to carry them all the way back to the car. So yeah, but she said they're not heavy though. And they don't look heavy, but. I can move the car up. The car. Oh yeah. It's so busy everywhere, obviously, because it is. 
Christmas Eve Eve. Yeah, there's like no shopping carts. And Michaela is trying to buy these $20 gray pillows. I'm I don't think I'm gonna like, do it. I don't think I'm gonna do it, y'all. No. She's gonna be on my top for the rest of the day. Like. Yeah, cause she keep trying to buy expensive stuff for no reason. Oh, y'all look for my little pookie. He's too big for all of this. Girl, where he gonna wear that to? When he goes he outside in the morning to go pee. <laughs> stuff in the house and then I decided to just hurry up and get back on the road um because I just don't like driving in the dark and I didn't want to I didn't really want to stay another night because I have somebody else watching my dog and I told well it's my sister but I told her I would be back today so yeah uh it's 5 30 now I'll be back home by 6 56 and I really don't like driving in the dark and it's getting dark right now so I'm basically just trying to, um, you know, really just beat the dark, really. I really hate driving at nighttime because I can't see. Although I wear glasses and you would think, like, damn, why can't this bitch see? I don't know. It's just something about driving in the dark that I just don't like. And then especially, really, it's just because I'm somewhere that I'm not familiar with. And I want to at least be able to see. And then also the way that they take me home um from Michaela city is like through hella fucking back roads so it's like better to do during the day because y'all i live in north carolina so it's always deers and animals and shit so i just prefer to be able to see and then like deers are always out at nighttime i don't really see deers during the day so yeah i just be trying to be you know cautious it's basically already dark now so i got my music playing and i'm just you know trying to concentrate on the road and shit because i've never took the drive to elizabeth city um by myself before yesterday was that yesterday yeah before yesterday and i damn sure never drove this far of a distance at night and then when i would leave michaela's house at night i would always have somebody else with me and they would do the drive during the night because i can't see them. so yeah i'm gonna be going straight for the next 59 miles <laughs> only have an hour and 25 minutes left so yeah i'm just trying to stay close by other cars so that like i'm not just on a straight dark road by myself basically like i'm just trying to you know keep up with the flow of traffic and shit like that which is not the problem because i mean <laughs> i do be speeding a little bit but i might call somebody to keep me up and keep me company so i can stay talking and stuff it's not that i'm sleepy i just wanna i don't know on my way here the drive did not feel long at all so yeah i was gonna just leave tomorrow morning but michaela has stuff to do so i didn't want to like be in the middle of like her plans and then also like i said my dog but damn i really wanted to record like more of the road trip part but it's dark now so y'all can't can't see me and i don't want to have this light on the whole time um but yeah i don't know i'm just vibing though i'm just driving i'm just you know i'm gonna probably update y'all when i got like 30 minutes left so that's in like a little over an hour I just made it back home like I've been back in my city since like six o'clock but I just went and got some food I got some wing stop because I haven't ate since I had Duncan earlier that shit just pissed me off I paid for the fucking ranch and you can't even put it in the fucking then they talk about my order gonna be ready at 806 it's 820 something food still not ready and I was on the way home I was like I hope Wingstop gave me ranch because I didn't check the bag because I was already irritated because, like, bro, every time I come in there and I place the online order, they start cooking my food when I get there. Like, what's the point of me even placing the online order? The point is not to wait. It's to, it's to pick it up and then go straight home. Whatever, y'all. Can I get a round of applause for me? because it is 9 14 a.m this video is supposed to go out today at 1 p.m and i woke up at like 6 a.m to get this finished and it's 9 14 and i just finished so yeah
round of applause, pat on the back. Who do you know? But I forgot to make an outro because it was supposed to be a whole nother day onto this video. But I, I'm kind of going through something. If you follow my spam, then you know. But yeah, your girl's just been going through it. So I didn't feel like recording the next day. So this is my outro because I just didn't want to leave y'all hanging like I would normally do. But I'm trying to get better with, um, you know making outros but this is my last video of 2023 um thank you guys so much for watching thank you guys for all the love and support that you have showed me this year i literally cannot thank you guys enough because without you like you watching this literally i would not be where i am today so thank you so much for supporting me whether you're a silent viewer whether you comment if you thumbs up the video if you follow me on instagram like whatever it is that you do in any way to support me thank you and i love you um i will see you very soon i'll see you next year <laughs> i'll see y'all next year with a brand new video i love y'all <laughs>